You're saying that therefore there is a contact from mind to matter which removes the whole physical chemical structure that's which right. keeps us that's going right. on with suffering. That's, that in that ending, there's a mutation in the brain cells. Yes, we well, discussed this some years ago, this yeah. question. Yes, but that, that, that mutation just wipes out the whole structure that makes uh, you yeah. suffer. Therefore, it's like I've been going along a certain tradition. I suddenly change that tradition. There is a change in the whole mm -hmm. brain, which has been going north. And now it changes, goes east. That is it. Yes, well, of course, this is a, a radical uh, notion from the point of view of uh, uh, traditional ideas in science because. Uh, if we accept that mind is different from matter, then it's hard. Uh, people would find it hard to say that mind would actually. Mind of folly, sir. Would you put it? Mind is pure energy. Well, we could put it that way. That, uh, 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 but say matter is energy too. Yes, but therefore, matter is limited. Thought is limited. Yes. Well, but we're saying that the pure energy of mind is able to reach into the limited energy Limit. of matter. Yes, that's right. And change the limitation. Yes, to, to remove if, some of the limitation. That's right. When there is a deep issue or problem, mm. which is, or a challenge which you are facing. Yes, so we have a thought, yes, so, and, and we, we have to also add that all the traditional ways of trying to do this cannot work because it they're. It hasn't worked. Well, not, that's not enough, we have to say, because people still might hope it could. You see, there's, it cannot actually. It cannot. Because thought cannot get at the basis of its own its own physical yes. chemical basis in the cells and do anything about those cells. <laughs> yes, sir. We've said that very clearly. Uh, Thought cannot bring about a change in itself. Yes, and yet practically everything that mankind has been trying to do is based on thought. Right? thought. There is a limited area, of course, where that's all right, but it, it, we cannot, therefore, as we said, you know, we're, we're discussing before, uh, do anything about the future of mankind from the usual approach. So look, that's what I'm, I'm when you listen to the politicians who are so very active in the world, they are creating problem after problem, and to them thought is the most important thing, ideas. Well, that nobody, generally speaking, nobody know, they can even exactly. know of anything else, you see that. Exactly. I will say, the only instrument which is thought is worn out, except in certain areas. Well, it never was adequate except in those areas. I mean, yeah, of course. Of course. But uh, um, and man has always been in trouble, as far as we can remember, as far as history goes. Right? Yes, sir. Man has always been in trouble, turmoil, fear. 